Hello, Scorpio. This is Tara Queen Jamila, and I'm here to do your um, Are You Happy psychic reading for November and December. So welcome to the channel. Make sure that you guys hit the subscribe button. And if you need a private reading, the link to my website is below. Um, also, if you have any concerns or if you are, um, sorry, let me turn this down a little bit. If you're looking for uh, spells and rituals that work, um, you can contact me be uh, down below also for a consultation, okay? All right, so I'm going to get started. Spirit guides, ancestors, guardian angels for the Scorpio, sun, moon, and rising. What messages do you have for Scorpio for the month of November and December? Show me November. Will Scorpio be happy? Yes or no? Major arcanas and even numbers is... Yes, and odd numbers and court cards is no. And also, show it, give us whatever guidance you have for the Scorpios. Okay. Alright, so for November, you guys did get a yes answer. But I can definitely see some issues in November. Um, <clears throat> I can see that a lot of you are possibly going to have um, either some sort of loss or job, loss of job, or maybe you're going to leave your job. Um, or maybe you're going to leave your old career path. Maybe you're going to leave it and go to another one. Um, let me throw out your cards for December. Spirit God, show me December. Yes or no. Is Scorpio happy? Is Scorpio happy in December 2018? Okay, so let's see here. <clears throat> we shall see. Okay, so in December, you did get a no answer for December. So... Could be a relationship let me just show you guys november you guys got the ace of pentacles inverted the five of pentacles upright the four of cups inverted or reversed the ten of wands reversed and sir nonos are either aka the devil in the inverted position so a lot of you are having difficulty in the month of november with an earth sign person now this could be money but it could also be a relationship with a person you might be dealing with a narcissist in the month of november scorpio and you're extremely sorry you're extremely sensitive to that extremely um and so i feel like the five of pentacles does represent it could be a finance thing, but if it's so, but it's it's for some of you, it's not going to be your finances. For some of you, you're just going to be feeling like you just are kind of lost or left out in the cold, or some sort of relationship is not going well with an earth sign. Um, four cups is inverted. I feel like you, the person is, it, it's it's just not making you happy. I feel like it's. I feel like you are happy, but you're not happy with a relationship. You're happy. And I was actually explaining this in the Libra video that just people assume that just because you're single or just because you are in a bad relationship, that that means that you're unhappy with yourself. And that's not always true. So a lot of people really do judge people. I feel like you are having issues in a relationship, but you're still happy. So I feel like that is really the main message for this, you know, for you guys is that you're still happy within yourself on some level, but it is a strained relationship. And for some of you, it's a long term relationship. For some of you, it's something that you're dealing with, with something going on within your family. Okay, bad juju, bad issues, um, you know, cycles not being broken, oppression, oppression. And then Sir Nono's reverse represents not feeling in control, um, feeling like you are 
stuck somewhere or either you're in bondage and you're in a situation that you can't get out of. Or either Sir Nono's reverse could represent that maybe it's a love relationship with somebody that's abusive. Okay. Like I said, I can sense, I got toys and stuff everywhere. Like I said, I can sense a bad relationship with a narcissistic person. Um, in particular, it could I'm seeing a Taurus because of Sir Nono's, because of the devil, but it could be a Virgo or a Capricorn, okay, in November. Now, in December, you guys got a no answer. Something's definitely going on. In December, you got the Seven of Pentacles inverted or reversed. You guys got the Three of Swords reversed. You got the Two of Cups reversed. You got the Queen of Pentacles reversed. And then you got the Chariot reversed. So I feel like it starts to weigh in heavy on you in December because you're feeling like you don't have anybody to depend on. And you're feeling like you're doing it all on your own. You're feeling like you don't have anybody to help you. Um, also, another thing that I'm seeing is that a lot of you in December are really, really feeling as though you are stuck in jobs or careers that is not paying you enough, but it's overworking you. So a lot of you are having some disappointments, some letdowns, uh, having to do with the finances in December. Um, it may have something to do with uh, maybe a financial endeavor that you are taking. Um, in particular, I can sense home. That's, that's Jacob. I was wondering if that was the cat and Jacob's making weird cat noises. Sorry about that. I was like, what is that? Okay, so anyway, you guys, the Two of Cups is inverted, and then the Queen of Pentacles is inverted. So I feel like I can see some disappointments during a home buying process. Either home buying, some kind of property buying, or maybe it's a car, or either furniture, or either Christmas gifts. It's something, it, it is some sort of financial letdown, but I feel like it's because, especially with Sir Nono showing up, there is, you know, whenever the devil shows up like that in a reading, especially in the reverse position, it shows that there may be some trickery. There may be some black magic that's being used. And then also I can sense, again, with this earth sign person, you not really being able to get away from whoever this is. So I can definitely see that too, uh, them causing some issues and maybe even causing some transportation issues in December. I feel like they've done it before, sort of slashed your tires or either, you know, uh, you know, tried to have, tried to, I don't know, have your car repoed or something crazy like that. Um, yeah, I can see a lot of you having some unhappy, some unhappy things playing out in a relationship with an earth sign in December. Now, the chariot in the reverse position tells me poss possible possible major transportation issues ahead so some of you need to be careful with that and you did get a no answer in december and i think mainly it's because of transportation issues and or you're feeling like you're not moving forward now i will tell you that with sir no no showing up for november you're not staying focused you're focused way too much on the problem and not the solution. When you spend too much time focusing on the problem, then you can't seem to find a solution or focus on it. Also, another thing, there are some of you that are possibly trying to purchase homes and you may be having trouble uh, getting financed. Perhaps you, uh, like for example, I'm self-employed and getting financed on a home can be extremely tricky when you're self-employed so you know that's something that you know to wear it's just one of those things you know that you have to have like perfect credit you've got to have your stuff together so that it can be presented the appropriate way because they sort of tightened up the home buying market so I can really see that 
a lot of you are trying to apply for homes. Um, I can see that even in the month of November, um, there being a need for possible new place in the month of November, but either not having the funds to get it or not having the credit to get it. So it's either you don't, you know, it's, you know, both, either way, both can pretty much screw you. So if you guys have any, if you guys need any financial advice or on how to unblock and manifest and you know manifest the things that you want as far as unblocking and then also for some of you there may be something generational going on like a generational hex and generational hexes work very very different because and and they they can sometimes be a lot worse because everybody in that family that's involved with that generational hex is constantly trying to oppress, 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 oppress. And hexes don't want to be broken. They don't. They don't want to be broken. So, anyway, guys, like I said, the link to my website is below if you guys need to reach me for a consultation. I'm always here. You probably have time for a turnaround before the holidays. Because I do, I do really feel as though there's some plans that you have that are set up around that time that are probably going to possibly fall through either because of the finances not being there or just, and I just feel like energetically that there's somebody that's trying to hold you back. So anyway, Scorpio, thank you so much for watching. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button, thumbs up, and if you guys need to reach me, you know how. Namaste.